Hello, ladies and gents, and welcome to Sonic C Sonic the Hedgehog CD. Made by Christian, Christian Whitehead. Whitehead. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I never so got that name. <laughs> Christian Whitehead. Okay, so for those who are wondering, uh, yes, I am playing the uh, recent uh, remake, question mark? More like, re more like remaster, I guess. Yeah, remaster is a more appropriate way of saying this. Um, yeah, I'm playing the remaster version because, one, it fixes a lot of issues that the original had, especially with, especially with, um, especially with music-wise. <laughs> And, um... Sonic in the background. Yeah. <laughs> so, what Sonic CD, what the, what the remaster also does, it also um, gives you the option to switch between the US and the Japanese version. Which one do you leave it on? Um, well, this is going to be a, a special playthrough in terms that, um, there's also, there's also a second feature that you can do. Um, but only after you pl complete the game at least once as Sonic, you can get to play as Tails. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot yeah. about that. Yes, so um, I decided to show that off that you can uh, as playing as Tails. Um, sure. Uh, yes. Showing off your trophies there. Yes, I still have yet to complete most of them. <laughs> but anyway, um, yeah. So as I'm playing Sonic, I'll be playing the Japanese version, and as uh, playing in the U and playing as Tails, I'll play the U.S. version. Oh, okay. Personally, I'm more of a fan of the uh, Japanese version, but the U.S. version has a few good tracks as well. Well, I love I love both um, the Japanese version and the U.S. version of the special stage theme. Anyway, without waste, let's not waste any more time. Let's play. Let's play Sonic the Hedgehog CD. No, this is Tails the Hedgehog CD. Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Anime cutscenes. You know, One when I saw this, I always wanted a, a Sonic cartoon actually done in this style, but I never got it. <laughs> Well, the closest you'll get is the Sonic OVA. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. But I wanted a cartoon series, not just a movie. I think they originally planned that, but then they decided to scrap that what idea. Oh, I would have liked to see that. We don't talk about that. <laughs> the Adventure of Sonic the Hedgehog. Okay, well, I love that. <laughs> uh, Sonic Underground. Never watched it. Oh, I remember that. Um, I used to want the, the, the music stuff, right? The, 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 only, three, yeah, the, the only... Three Hedgehog. Uh, I was gonna say the only thing that I remember from Sonic Underground is seeing the GIF where Knuckles fall, where Knuckles slowly fall off the cliff. Sonic picks him back up, and then he, and then Knuckles shrinks in size. <laughs> That's the only <laughs> thing I ever need to see. <laughs> and then there's Sonic setting him, which is I meh. <laughs> meh. <laughs> hey, I like hey, Sonic. Uh, not bad the Mega Man cartoon. Oh, we don't talk about that one either. <laughs> what, the Ruby Spears cartoon? <laughs> oh, actually, no, I should never know. I take that back. That, that's actually pretty funny. Well, it's funny to laugh at, but for the wrong reasons. The, only, the, the best scene about that is the one where Dr. Light pushes Roll down. That's just the funny Yeah, I, scene. I, I, I love that gif. <laughs> <laughs> she tries to comfort him, he just turns around and pushes her down for no reason. Or Gutsman's ass. Or gut, Yeah, Gutsman's ass. Or everyone's favorite, now I've got your power. He's taking my power. But enough about Mega Man. This is Sonic. Okay, one thing I kind of was disappointed about was that turns out that, um, as it turns out, they they actually took out the lyrics of "You Can Do Anything" theme, which was playing for that intro. Uh, Three, to be honest, due to licensing issues. To be honest, I actually prefer it without lyrics. <laughs> uh, I miss the lyrics. As 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 much as it really did not make much sense. <laughs> Oh, and another feature they added to this game is there's actually two different versions. Fuck. <laughs> I was gonna say the platform <laughs> fucked you over. Um, yeah, there's two different versions of the spin dash you can achieve in this game. Um, there's the uh, the original, which is basically a spin charge, where you hold the button down until it, tar until it charges enough. Or you can just do the the classic spin dash, where you tap the button to charge it up. I'm using the classic version because it, it throws me off <laughs> using the original. I actually prefer the super peel out. To the uh, to the regular spin dash. No, the PL is still there, but like the spin jet, the spin dash I'm talking about. Oh, like oh the, there's like the a one I'm doing. Oh, there's a different type now. Yeah, the one I did just now is the original. Is the original. Oh, the, okay. uh, the the one the Sonic CD originally had oh, was a spin. Was kind of like a spin charge, where like you hold the button. Oh, okay. Yeah, you actually hold the button until it charges up enough. Because every time where you just tap, if you because you know how you know how with the original you can just tap the button and you, you, and it's enough to get him going. Yeah. The charge, is, the charge doesn't work that way. If it's not enough, then Sonic will just stand in one place like a dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
Which I'm glad they changed. <laughs> yes. Um, well, you can go back to it if you don't want it. If you, if you want to go back to the old way. Uh, I'm going to ask because it might just be me. Is anybody else's sound effects for the video kind of off, or is that just me? Yeah, my record... Yeah, it's, I don't know why, but YouTube messed up. Yeah. Because <laughs> I, just, I just checked the original video for some reason, and it was playing just fine. Ah, uh, so it's YouTube's fault. Yeah. Oh, uh, well, I guess... So, well, since you have the original video, as long as the original video works fine, and when you re-export it, it should be fine. Um, yeah, the explosion okay. sprites like it's a bit over the top, don't you think? What for the uh for the robot ma making machine? Yeah, like all these like 16-bit explosion sprites, like the Mega Man ones in general, also like they're like you just like <laughs> one one robot blows up, millions of explosions everywhere, <laughs> and the entire screen turns white just for that. <laughs> it's like a Michael Bay film. Now, if you really want to see a Michael Bay film, then you play Sonic 1 Michael Bay Edition. Yeah. Yes, that actually does oh, yeah. exist. <laughs> yes, it does. <laughs> and my god. <laughs> it's exactly what you expect it to be, to be. I have a picture in my mind, and, like, I, I'm, trying, I'm going to see if that's actually going to be the real thing. Here, Ramon, here, just imagine it like this. Imagine Sonic 1, tons of explosions, and a Virtual Boy filter. That... That's all you need to know. That doesn't sound half bad, actually. <laughs> you say that now. <laughs> yeah, not not yeah, but it's not as psychedelic as some of these special stages can look. <laughs> I'm it, not kidding. Is it literally one of the special stages you tripping ass? <laughs> uh, you will see. You will see later in this playthrough that yes. <laughs> wait, why is there like? But, uh, wait, why is there Earth over? Wait, what? Y y yeah, you see, you see what I mean. <laughs> What, was you, the, you, what were the, the developers of Sega doing when they were making this? Like I said, you, you, yeah, you think you think this is messed up? You just wait till the red, till later on. <laughs> anyway, so um, basically, basically, this game actually has uh, it has three different endings. There is the bad ending, the good ending, and the true ending. So um, what am I getting, aiming for? The true ending, of course. No, you want to get the you want to get the bad ending. <laughs> You the want you want Robotnik to win. Yeah, the bad ending. The bad ending makes you feel like shit. <laughs> like you, you did all this effort only for it to have, like only for it to like you know fail. <laughs> like it didn't mean a goddamn thing. <laughs> but um, what was I gonna say? Uh, yeah. In order in order to achieve the bad ending, you just basically just play through the levels and don't do anything. Oh, so um, you play it like a Sonic game? <laughs> pretty much. Um, the the good ending is basically the the robot generator that I destroyed in the first zone. I'm about to I'm about to find the next one right now. Um, basically, there's this robot generator in the past of every of every uh, zone, which this game again the level system is weird. It's changed too, but anyway, um, there's a past version of every of every level, and in order in order to get the good good future um, for each zone, you have to find all the robot generators. And they're only in the past. So as, once you destroy them in the once you destroy them in the past, that um, pretty much the future is good in the in that zone. In order to get the good future in the third zone, you have to make sure both both uh, generators are done in the first two. I isn't it also possible to uh, obtain the good? Not exa I don't think it's a good future, but you can actually get a good er uh, better ending if you uh, even if you don't get all the robot generators, you just get all the time stones. Yeah, you you just need to get the time stones really to actually get the true ending. So it, like, my efforts right now really doesn't mean much. Oh, you're just doing it just because completionist. I'm just completionist. Completionist makes you feel uh, completionist makes you feel better about yourself and. Robotnik's a dick. Robotnik's a dick. Yes. <laughs> and uh, and also I'm 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 doing my best to go out of my way to find all the generators, but after years of playing the game for the true end with the true ending, I kind of forgot some of them. Ah. Uh. One thing I do hate, though, is that whenever you go to the past, you hit a future sign, and then you end up building up speed because you end up going through a long loop. I hate that because then you just screw yourself out of getting the generator yeah, if you didn't get I, it already. Yeah, I'm doing my best not to activate. Do the um, like, well, when when you're looking for the generators, you do your best not to find the run into the future signs. <laughs> or you, or you, you're generally uh, taking your time because you don't want to miss it. And then, well, yeah, the, I mean, the thing is about the thing is about Sonic. Uh, and by the way, I'm going for some ranks. I need. I'm trying to get 50 rings in order to find the uh, special stage ring. Oh yeah, there's also oh. the Metal Sonic uh, uh, hologram that you can just... Which... They're pointless. Yeah, they, they don't do anything, they just make you feel good. <laughs> they don't do anything in this game. They're... Like, um, I mean, at least at least in the in the remastered, in this version, um, you get an achievement for finding all of them. 
But the only thing you really do is let animals appear in the past and present. Um, was this the first game with that like design of Metal Sonic? Yes, this is the well. This is the, actually this is Metal Sonic's debut. Oh. So if you were to if you were to, if you were to uh, skip out Sonic CD and just play and play you know go through all the Sonic games, you'll probably wonder where the f <laughs> where, who the fuck is this guy? <laughs> where did he come from? Pretty much, yeah. All right. Because they never explain. Because if you didn't play Sonic CD, you're never gonna know. Uh, minus that huge planet, this isn't that trippy. It looks like. It looks like Satani from from Star Fox. <laughs> Wait, is that supposed to be a planet? I don't. Know. I always thought it was just a really rounded off mountain. Yeah. So we're so we're so we're Mario now. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> no, they don't have eyes. Yeah, you're right. They don't. <laughs> True. <laughs> Needs more mushrooms. <laughs> All right. Now so I feel kind of dumb for not thinking that's a planet. I always just thought it was a really rounded mountain. <laughs> um. So uh, the special stages, um, the way how they worked is, well, as you can see, kill all the, just pretty much destroy all the UFOs. Um, but at the same time, the at the same time, do not fall in the water. <laughs> yeah, because if you step in the water, it re it tremendously reduces the amount of time that you have. Yeah, um, if you do, if you if you are low on time, there there is a UFO that will show up in the middle of the stage, and you can use it to extend your time there. But um, just for the love of God, do not fall in the water, especially in the later later special stages. <laughs> And plus, chances are by the time that UFO shows up, you'll be so low on time anyway that you probably won't get to it in time before you lose the special stage. Well, at least it's stationary, so it's easy to uh, to, to to hit because the other because the other UFOs um, they get they, they they're constantly moving. That and there is that, but also at the same time, the controls for this really aren't the best. Well, well for the, for the special stage, I should say. It's not that bad. I don't have too much trouble with it. I just it's hate. Just... I just hate turning. I, I I can't stand turning in the special stages. Is it better than Sonic well, 2's controls for their special stages? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> kinda. Oh, yeah, and that was a boss. Yeah. <laughs> wow. That, that, was, was, that was pathetic. Yeah. <laughs> that was pathetic. <laughs> Eggman. Eggman in the oh, or Robotic, whichever. Um, he's incredibly pathetic in this game. <laughs> yeah, he he is. The bosses are he's a joke. <laughs> Yeah, he's more. His, his boss fights are more of a gimmick, uh, more of a gimmick uh, boss than uh, than an actual like you're fighting a boss type of thing. So basically, that boss is, um, you can easily. I mean, that boss is easily to own be simply because you can appear behind him and just like um, basically smack his ass until he dies. Kinky. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, and I'll explain more into the next part. 